Well, hello there. You smell amazing today. Well, good evening, ladies, lasses, and lassos, and welcome to The Click. Today we're going to get an amazing subreddit, and we're going to have so much fun. It's called Suspicious Quotes, where everything is in quotes, where it's probably not supposed to be, so everything just comes off really sarcastic, and the messaging is probably not really what the person have in mind. When you want to emphasize something, don't use quotes, because it's really weird. Enjoy. Mwah. Did you know that I'm working on an emotional support demon plushie? <laughs> I'm working on an emotional support demon plushie. <laughs> you know, when I retire, I'm just gonna make a plushie company and make like cute but questionable plushies. And there is nothing you can do to stop me, so don't even try. Oh yes. Spice up any Facebook comment with random quotation mark. Congrats on your baby. Congrats on your baby. Congrats on your baby. This is amazing, because the first one is basically, it's not really congrats. <laughs> Welcome to misery. The second one is, it's probably not your baby. I planted it there. That's that's how it works, right? And the second one is that, that's that's not a baby. That's a little gremlin. Stop. Cease. You must be 21 to enter. What? <laughs> what do you, what do you, <laughs> what, does this mean older or not 21? Or can anyone who's like not 21, older or younger join? Is this like a really weird... <laughs> In first age control, you're free to enter at any age except 21. Enjoy your safe holiday on Rodos. <laughs> That's an amazing advert. Do you have too many children? Come to this safe holiday and come back with fewer. Woo! Uh, please pay for these products at the counter. Are you just telling people to shoplift? This can't be a a a a a a, a, a sustainable business idea. That was the word I'm looking for. I need more coffee. Jesus, my brain is just... Ring bell for meat service. I've seen weird things in grocery stores around the world, okay? But like, meat service is probably not one of them, right? It's like, hey there, uh, mom of a family and you little kids, do you want some meat service to... Stop! Jesus! <laughs> Why would you write it like this? <laughs> It's just flabbergastingly astounding. We all have that one friend who eats too much pizza. <laughs> yeah, you know, when you have a sleepover party with the bros and, and one of your friends just eats way too much pizza. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that friend. Please feel free to ask one of our lovely baristas for a second service. Enjoy! Oh, I will definitely enjoy the second service. Will they write my name on that sir? This is getting into really weird territory, isn't it? <laughs> I just... <laughs> Starbucks after hours? That's what this screams to me. You know, your little your little squeeze just comes out with your name written on it. It's oh my god. There's something I would expect in like Game of Thrones or something. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Putin wins. Russian presidential election. Yeah, that seems about right. I still remember that. I had a video around election time in the US, and I had such problem getting through monetization, and I didn't know why. But it was because I had an election joke in there, and the YouTube algorithm thought I was like talking smack about the election or manipulating things or something. The joke was very funny. It was like, uh, my god, why is it taking so long for the US to count votes? And then someone in the comments was like, here in Mother Russia, we know the results before we even vote. And it's, it's like so funny. And YouTube was like, no, this is manipulative. New construction, residential, commercial, service, and repair this number. We do it all honestly. <laughs> I love I love dishonest residential areas. Nothing nothing tickles my fancy quite like it. More bang for your buck. Treat your family to something fresh baked. Wait, hold on. So so you're not supposed to treat your family and it's going to be something stale. So you just give stale bread to random people. That's that's what this means. That is so strange. I need your help to be re-elected so I can finish the work that I started. What is... <laughs> okay, what does it actually mean? I need your not help to be not elected so I can begin the leisure that I stopped. I don't know, may may maybe you should run this by, you know, some kind of advice or something before publishing this. I can't, be I can't believe that they actually spent a marketing budget on this. That that's amazing. Enjoy living in your home. <laughs> Limit your risk. Prepare for the unexpected. Is this just a threat? Is this just like a mafia letter? That's just, oh, it would be a shame if you stopped living in your home. <laughs> quotes can be really threatening. Is that a subreddit that exists? Threatening quotes? I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, please ensure to close the door completely. We have milk and dishwashing liquid getting stolen every fortnight. <laughs> Why do people do this? 
this is just so confusing. Stop! Why does Melania Trump always look like she's trying to ban spoons with her mind? Are you suggesting it's not really her? I think it's a deep fake. Every, every, every person is a deep fake, except, except me. That's my new favorite conspiracy. You're fake. Wow, Timmy, you sure look real today. Mmm. Scientist. Cockroach milk. Hold, hold, hold on. What do you mean by mil- It's remarkably rich in protein, fat, and sugar. I swear if someone offers me cockroach milk as a refreshment, I'm whooping their ass. But also like milk. Do you, do you actually mean that it's a different liquid coming out of roaches that is- that you're actually talking about, but you have to make it family friendly for the public and this is really disturbing, CNN. Please. A qualified mechanic wanted. Apply inside. Three weeks ago, original post. And today. <gasps> My god, the subreddit fixed it! There is hope for humanity after all. You see that making memes about things sometimes does they make the world a slightly better place. At least it removes really <laughs> questionable formulations and random job applications. <laughs> well, we'll take all the small improvements we can, won't we? Ah, oh, we got a little form. Print last name. Last name! <laughs> well, it is technically correct, but... Oh, it's Trumpy Wumpy. How, how does he sound? Join! No, that's kind of like, we must keep evil out of our country. What do you mean evil? <laughs> we must keep evil in the country. Yes, young Skywalker, embrace the dark side, you little sight. Could you get milk on the way home? Thumbs up. And also, could you try to find cranberry juice? I will uh, try to find cranberry juice. It's a code word for very, very questionable substances. Dad wrote, my daughter became period for the first time on the bus today. A boy who was a year older than herself pulls my daughter over and says in her ear, look, there's a stain on your pants. Don't be shocked. Wrap my sweater around your waist and go home. Today, I wanted to thank this boy's mother for raising such a child. I wanted to share with you a positive note in the world where we keep hearing bad news. It's such a wholesome story, but it's just, the formulations are so concerning. <laughs> what do you mean? To be fair, though, this is like a really wholesome, really like helpful little thing. I like that. That's a very cute story, despite, despite the questionable quotations. Oh, it's Sans. I already befriended your mom last night. <laughs> Sans? Sans, what are you- What are you talking about? Sans, please. Please, I'm just trying to enjoy your game. Sans, for the love of God. Sorry, we do not accept credit cards. <laughs> Try to figure out that point, you stupid butt. We are a very quirky store. We like to have fun here. <laughs> but how do I pay? <laughs> you have to figure that out. <laughs> Can you imagine a store that does like an escape room thing? You just go into a grocery store and to be able to check out your groceries you have to solve like some weird puzzle to get out. But I have to pick up my kids! You have to escape the room first otherwise you're stuck here forever. And you have to drink raw milk for the rest of your life. Should've thought twice about having groceries, Susan. There will not be a dance party in this building tonight. It would be more fun if the not was in quotation marks. <laughs> what do you mean dance party? <laughs> Does this mean there will be a dance party? I don't understand! Here's a sticky old jar of honey. <laughs> we harvest this honey in very questionable methods. It doesn't come from bees, but it's just as sweet and sticky. Use your imagination. What a treat. Asking your audience to use their imagination is within YouTube guidelines, right? I think so. Facebook wanted flute teacher. <laughs> if interested, please ping me. I would love to learn how to properly play the flute. It's gonna be very fun. Are you really good with your fingers as well? With your flute? Like 90% of the subreddit is just unintentional innuendos. I swear to God, it's amazing. Missouri man breaks into multiple women's homes to tell them he respects them in celebration of International Women's Day. Well, here the quotation mark feels actually appropriate, right? Because if you break into someone's home, it's not like the most Respectful thing to do, just gonna be honest, fam. You have unread messages from Rex. Rex, congrats on the new job. I am very pleased to see you progressing your career in such a large organization. I am sure you earned the promotion. Rex, Rex, what are you suggest? Rex, what are you suggesting? Rex, please, Rex, stop. If you're having a bad day, always remember this guy. He pushed the front seat without knowing Putin was sitting on it. Okay, this goes into the same conspiracy. Everyone is just a deep fake, I think. 
Yeah, that's what this means. <laughs> Glorious subreddit. This baby is excited to get pajamas that match the family dog. Look at the- Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean pajamas? Did you just have two dogs? Is that why it's in quotation marks? Oh, this is totally pajamas. We totally didn't- didn't stuff our baby inside the second dog, and now they match, because that's where my mind went to by default. That That's where my mind- that's great. That's absolutely amazing. Wow. Robot priest can beam light from its hands and give automated blessings. <laughs> I was like, priest. But also, how would this actually work? It's, it's just little photons from a little machine. Who determines if a robot is holy or not? Like, how, how do you actually determine that? Do you measure the holiness of the light? I don't get this. You could just claim that anything is holy. Why not just a normal light bulb? Why? Our eye doctor will see you soon. <laughs> <laughs> Papa John's founder. I didn't eat 40 pizzas in 30 days. I... Had 40 pizzas in 30 days. Did, uh, did he freak the pizzas? Yes, yes he did. Smile with pride. Thank you, Colgate. My wife and our kids use your product and will continue to do so. That's kind of cute. It's like, smile with pride. And this dude is like, hey there, my wife, aka husband, are enjoying your smile with pride. That's that's kind of like a hidden little cutesy message, right? That's pretty wholesome, right? I like this one. It's the first wholesome one in this godforsaken video. This coffee is served with a cloud of cotton candy. The coffee vapor rises to dissolve the cotton candy, and the cloud begins to rain with sugar over the coffee. Coffee mellow in Shanghai, China. What do you mean, cotton candy? <laughs> what is it? Cocaine? Or is it just cotton mixed with... I don't... What? <laughs> This is so concerning. What is it? A Texas barbecue plus live band. So when you put live band, you just you just place regular like a Spotify playlist. But we told you it was a live band. <laughs> no money back. What people think about pit bulls? Rawr. Reality. What do you mean? What do you mean rea- This is so confusing. What do you mean? Do you mean that all the pit bulls are just like filtered? On Instagram, that's that's the takeaway. I guess that's the takeaway. That's how I would interpret this. Interpret it. I am good with words. McDonald's know our food. All of our chicken McNuggets are are made from actual chicken. The breast meat is removed from the bird and then mixed together with seasoning prior to forming the chicken McNuggets. Are the nuggets are then coated with tempura style batter. Ah yes, real chicken. <laughs> it is plastic. My Daddy said, if I got 200 likes, he will stop smoking. <laughs> Please like and share. <laughs> what do you mean, stop smoking? <laughs> Please, I can't do it. <laughs> oh, God, I had too much coffee for this. A church parking only, violators will be baptized. <laughs> More like raptured. <laughs> what do you mean, baptized? I just see the priest coming in like, Oh, you parked in the wrong spot. Come here, dear citizen. I'll take you in to baptize you and just freaking drown you in holy water. That's what I that's what I see in front of me when I read this. Dr. John Soidberg, M D. Why is specifically the M in what what is it what does the D mean on its own? It's just John Soidberg D. Please don't do cocaine in our bathroom. I'm getting very conflicted messages here. Do you mean that I should do cocaine in your bathroom? That would be a very surprising sign to see at your grandma's house when you come in. Just a hand. What? How? What? Crochet? Crotched? People are very upset when I call this crotching. Anyway, when you see like a handmade crotching thing on the wall like this, um, and and it says like, "Do please do cocaine in our bathroom." I think I'd be concerned for my grandma, to be honest. <laughs> I love crotching. Touch this rock to discover what the cave feels like. Th this just takes my mind down such a heckin' dirty road. It's like, touch this, totally this thing, to feel the inside of the totally this thing. How can, how can you not take this as innuendo? How, how can you not? How, who made this? If you are caught leaving trash and broken glass in pool area, you will be banned. What, what do you mean ban? Maybe it's like, you know, banned. It's like, oh, totally banned. You will never reach the pool again. It's because you're dead. It's because we had you eat all the glass to clean it up. But, you know, we say it's banned because it sounds better on the board. When you fake a letter your mom had to write to the school. Hello, this is your mother. Please come over to my house for meatloaf. Leave your front door open and your lawn unguarded. Sincerely, mom. Not the zombies. <laughs> for... 
Meat loaf. Okay, so it's it's like a zombie thing, right? I I, I was I was concerned first. Meat loaf. It's like, hey there, teacher. Can you come to my place and we can discuss son's grades over intimate. Meatloaf, but it's just zombies, so it's fine. They're just here to murder you, okay? So it's wholesome. Those quotes, though. Police! Professional law enforcement. <laughs> We're here to protect and serve. <laughs> Where is this from? Where is this? <laughs> Who designed this? Either someone like really just whooshed what quotation marks mean, or someone is like inside, just I am gonna ruin the police marketing by putting quotation marks around all the good stuff. She hates him as much as we do. I am a dentist, and her body language tells me that she is in pain. What do you mean dentist? I collect teeth as a hobby. I, I am a I am a passionate amateur dentist, if I may say so myself. I have a collection of teeth. No, yes, a shocked YouTube thumbnails. Who knows me better? My girlfriend or my sister? Oh dear, this can mean this this can this oh no oh no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Attention, please do not put your fingers in cages. Rabbits have teeth. Mmm, tea. What is it? Tea. It's gonna really do things to your fingers. Lord of the Rings star Elijah Wood welcomes the first baby as girlfriend gives birth. What is this supposed to Elijah Wood, please. Daddy turns 40 tomorrow. Don't forget to make him something. Turns 40 tomorrow. So, so it's 50? Having a crisis and you want to pretend it's 40? Is that what this means? That's kind of innocent. Right? Is this a bit of a crisis? Ring bell. Wait for response. State your business. <laughs> if you, if you know what I mean, your business. Oh yes, indubitably. This is a happy home. <laughs> we have fun on this channel. <laughs> have you tried our soups yet? Yum. <laughs> This is probably not the marketing. And I also love the winking smiley. The whole thing is just so incredibly sarcastic. Real fact number 719. A strawberry is not an actual berry, but a banana is. Find more real facts at Snapple.com. What do you mean? Is, so is it a real fact or is it not a real? Is it the reverse? I am so concerned right now. Security guard. <laughs> it's the reverse. He makes sure that the place is just a little bit unsafer than it would be by default. Mm, just what we all need. Population control. I buy horses. Large, small, strange, regular. I bought every horse I have ever seen. Here's a number. Easy way to earn fast cash. So does it mean that it's slow cash or does it mean that it's not actually cash? Or is it slow as something else? What? The... Potato and egg shop. Is potato and egg like code word for something, something shady? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I'm really concerned. Inside a surprise gift from Donald J. Trump. Uh, no thanks. Hewitt police proudly serving our community. Oh, you mean like you know? It's not really our. Just okay. Okay, I see what you did there. The wearer of this helmet still lives. Wear yours. I don't think this kind of like inspirational marketing really worked out the way you intended. The picture also looks really old, so even if the helmets save them, maybe they don't live anymore. I don't know. This is really confusing. I'm, I'm supposing it's like a wholesome message, like, oh my god, helmets save lives, but don't write it like this. It has a very opposite effect. <laughs> oh yeah, wearing this helmet will totally save your life. You're gonna be alive for so long. No. When I was... Seven. I was in a hospital for a few months with a secret reason. My aunt brought me a snake to make me feel better. I tried to eat it, but my mother slapped it out of my hand and got away. We never found it. His name was Slippy. This ask has so many questions around it. Why did he try to eat the snake? Why was the hospital visit secret? Was it secret to you as well? Why are the quotation marks around the number seven? W weren't you actually seven? This is so upsetting. Thank you. Grandma baked a cake for the team, but her use of punctuations made it sound sarcastic. Heroes! <laughs> well, oh my god, you all did a very good job. This is something I would love to do if I still worked in an office. Like, good job, team! <laughs> and just not say anything about it and just watch like the nervous stare so people are like, Wait, is it is it actually a good thing? I don't I don't understand. Must be 18 or with parent to buy swords. But okay. 
Mumbai police, don't be pulled into making a gargantuan mistake. Hashtag say no to drugs. That white line leads to a black hole, don't follow. <laughs> Well, that's, a, that's an interesting marketing thing. I guess this was around the time when that first image of the black hole was uh, was uh, properly made. But that's pretty wild. And also the quotations is uh, like, what? So don't be pulled. So be pulled into making a small mistake. This is weird marketing, Mumbai. Just gonna put it out there. BBC News. US man killed in India by endangered tribe. What is... What is... Okay. Here's a bunch of stuff. Oysters, king crab, the salt bay, vos still, sprite, one, spaghetti. Spaghetti. <laughs> oh yeah, look at these suckers. They ordered the spaghetti. <laughs> Silly white folks. Se Sesame Street, elbow. We are good friends. What do you mean elbow? Isn't it Elmo? What do you mean elbow? <laughs> Am I just missing something? What are we, we are good, friend. This is so cursed. What is going on? And it looks completely drugged out, not gonna lie. Elbow, we good, friend. <laughs> Warning, electric fence. Well, maybe the quotations actually make sense here because this very much looks like a, just a wooden fence. I, I don't think it's electric. So, I mean, that, that makes sense. Maybe this is on purpose, like <laughs> electric fence. But why would you even write it? Shopping at all these is like entering a parallel universe. Take it, four fingers. Diet, Dr. Bob. Mountain shouting. <laughs> Cream between us. Wow, I totally thought it was butter. Wait, wait, what does that actually mean? Hold on. So I totally thought it was butter without the quotation mark. It's like, then you know, oh, it's something fake butter. It's like vegan, and it, but it tastes the same. But now it's like, I totally thought it was butter. So that means you totally thought it was fake butter, but it's actually real butter but it's just so bad that you think it's fake. That's not good marketing. Hmm, but in quotations. <laughs> what does that mean? It means I'm not thinking. My brain is so done with this. Ancient Egyptians are animal crap for medicine. N and now USA legalized anal. <laughs> what, <are> you <laughs> what on earth are you talking about? This is just all over the place. <laughs> what? And what do you mean by this? What, what does this mean? Please do not use staples for posting. Please do not use quotation marks for emphasis. There we go. Yes, we can change the world. One quotation at a time. We can change the world. <laughs> Don't enter mirror. Are you suggesting it's not actually a mirror. Store is not responsible for any costs covering getting you back from Narnia or whatever. But that's in a closet, right? Where does the mirror go? Is it just the demon realm? I would kind of like to go there. That's a good marketing. A sticker grows on the apple while it is still hanging on the tree. Wait, what are you talking? First off, I probably not. No, but but what are you? What do you, what do you mean? What do you mean? Welcome, everyone is invited from 1 p.m. until 2 p.m. every Tuesday. Come in and listen to our Bible reading session. <laughs> hey there, you want to come by uh, tomorrow and listen to Bible readings? It's not a Bible reading. It is incredibly sinful. It's going to be a blast. Oh, yes, indeed. Got wet. Needs cleaning. What got... What did you do to the chair? What, what happened here? City school district, regrettably, will be closed tomorrow due to the weather. <laughs> It's just, everything is so sarcastic. I don't know, do they actually mean the weather? What What would it be if it's not the weather? The weather. What? what? Happy Father's Day, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> when you're adopted, but your parents haven't told you, but you found out, and it's like, this is the way you make a statement. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Yeah, how about that? Yeah, you see, I know. What an incredibly dramatic cake. Fresh fudge. Testing today. Yum. Please, please, no fudge when you say it like that. Does, it's not something edible. It's very gross. 23F. I am looking to have a good time on my kick. R slash lost redditors. Why is the 23 in quotes? That gives me very creepy vibes. What, what do you mean, like, in, in quote, does that mean that's not actually the, oh, no, oh, no, God. This just gives me vibes to those, like, shady underground circles, like on TikTok and shite, where, you know, very questionable things are watched by questionable people, and uh, and this is just some kind of code wording for it. it, it that's obviously innocent quotations with a bulk bot just advertising stuff, but, like, that's the vibe I get, and it makes me uneasy, man, makes me uneasy. Cement shoes factory, zero days since last 
accident. <laughs> well, this is probably on purpose, right? That's a really funny comic because accident. Cement shoes isn't something you do by accident. It's when you want someone to take a nap with the fishies. So it's not really an accident, but it's an accident. Would it be a shame if you just had an accident? <laughs> French martini, vanilla vodka, jambord, pineapple puree, and sugar cane syrup shaken with ice, finished with love. They add some love to it, <laughs> so it's extra creamy. This is just so on the nose. Like, did nobody see this when they wrote this? This is, oh yeah, we put some extra love into your drink. C come on, man. C really? <laughs> Re really? We do not accept stolen merchandise. This is just obviously trying to get in on the black market. We do not. We totally accept stolen merchandise. It's like the perk in Skyrim and speech. Like, now you can sell stolen stuff. It's really handy. Add water for a magic milk surprise. What do you mean magic milk surprise? This is really concerning. Is this a toy? I don't want my magic milk surprise, please. In loving memory of Jen and Ted South, two of life's nice people. <laughs> that is so passive aggressive. <laughs> Help yourself. Free drink while you're waiting for food. Water, tea, lemonade. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to eating the food. It's gonna be so tasty. Please ring bell for service. It says everything is just reversed. This means nothing. Stop it. Egg cuber makes a square egg. <laughs> so what do you mean? It's not for eggs or it doesn't make it square? What do you, what do you mean? Enjoy your stay, Sandra. <laughs> Is this a threat? I don't like being threatened by Holiday Inn. Please, sir. Add facts for genius. Did you know the black diamond is a rare apple with a jet black hue? It tastes sweeter than honey and it's only found in Tibet. What? JFK. Just F kids. Schoolwear. What? <laughs> just F kids. This is probably not the slogan that you think it is. What? What are you- this, this is not a quirky, like, saying. This is just really bad. Did you know the American flags placed on the moon are now white due to radiation from the sun? Maybe they did it just to be inclusive, you know? It's just not... <laughs> Why do you put white in quotation marks? I don't get it. Ooh, everyone loves a little ball sack biking. Free heart-shaped lead bike light. At least they put it in quotations because they know what it really looks like. They are at least self-aware. I love my rescue dog. Do you mean it's not actually a... D what is it? What, what is it? <laughs> if it's not a dog. Dear parents, if you want to find out where your son slash daughter is in the house, simply turn off the Wi-Fi and wait! Exclamation question mark! <laughs> Damn, boomer memes do be hitting differently, but also the quotations are just a complete disaster. <sighs> I'm so glad I'm not on Facebook meme pages. We love you. You have been a great dad, and we would like to thank you for teaching us love and family matters. Rachel Bovier, Pittsburgh Potess, giving thanks to you with a stuffing full of love. Is is this just like a brothel that's disguised as a restaurant? <laughs> we will do your turkey stuffing, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Come in for a free sample. <laughs> Happy New Year, son. I hope you have a wonderful 2020. Love and hugs. This is a really weird way of telling someone they're adopted. <laughs> Beast Bodies. Girl 9 gets excited when bitten by snakes. Formulations are very important. Muy importante. Through these doors pass the greatest people on earth. Our customers. <laughs> well, gee, I know when I'm not shopping again. Look at this little thing at a restaurant. This is cheese. Mm hmm. It's cheese. You want some cheese on your food? <laughs> you like that cheese, don't you? We are not in the same boat. We are in the same storm. Some have yachts, some are canoes, and some are drowning. Just be kind and help when you can. It's a really good analogy for the world, right? But, but like the quotations make it questionable. I am proud to be an American and a Christian. But no one passes this on because they are scared to admit they are too. It's a very unclear me not gonna. What does this mean? <laughs> If you would like a maid service, please put the maid service sign outside your door before 12 p.m. Thank you. What do you mean by maid service? What? Sheriff, making a difference. <laughs> Why do they put all the slogans in quotations? It's so bad. No kids under 18 allowed. That, that, 
What what do you mean? Delicious apples. Um num num. Uh, delicious apples. Is this where everything comes from? Is just disgruntled customers adding quotations to every sign they find of something they don't like? That's kind of an amazing backstory. Critical space flight hardware. Do not touch. And then he touches it because it's in quotation marks, you see? Absolutely amazing. Happy Halloween from your pal. <laughs> hey there, we are friends. Uh, totally. 18. This single text out of context is just incredibly concerning. The most dangerous quotations found on Earth. Do not leave children unattended in the toy area. So, do, yes, leave children attended. I mean, I guess it's a double negative, so it's the same meaning, I, I guess, but it's just really weird. A call 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Speak with a live occupational healthcare professional. This is just basically saying that everything is bots. Yeehoo! Got my results back. I am negative for COVID-19. <laughs> is this on purpose? This? Maybe it's like quoting the result, you know? It's like, they said I'm negative on the test, which makes sense, but it's also, it comes off so sarcastic, man. Family restaurant. Live entertainment. Fine dining. Fun. Established 1960. Why, why is everything in quotes? <laughs> because it's not really... It, it's a family thing, but it's not a restaurant, and it's live entertainment. Fine dining and fun. Tell you what, Bobby, if you and your pals take turns sprinting with me every afternoon to help me build up the wind, I'll see that you get ringside seats Saturday night. It's a deal, chick. How about it, fellas? What do you mean, uh, sprinting? I need, I need to practice my stamina. How about it? It's, 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 it's real. The undertone is re really bad. Barbie, let's make a support drop with first aid and food boxes. <laughs> Dear God, Barbie. <laughs> what do you mean? What, what is actually in it? What are you, Barbie, what are you doing? Obama would like to access the microphone. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go on a limb and say nah. Select any dietary restriction that apply to you. Vegetarian, vegan, gluten-free, nut. Allergy? <laughs> what kind of event are you planning? And also, what kind of nut are you referring to? The underlying messages in this video is just astoundingly good. I, I love this. Well, laddies, lasses, and lassos, that is it for this video. I do hope you learned a lot of things about human communication and how it's non-existent. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have an amazing rest of your day because you do deserve it. And I will see you in the very near future. Take care. Mwah. Oh.